Unknown has sent you new data to your cloud hub. All right. So who do we betray this time? What's this now? A lab? Testing speech module. Congratulations on purchasing the Space 5 Android. Preparing configuration. Configuration complete. Speech module testing successful. So, my friend, now you can speak. Look at me and say good day. Good day, sir. How may I help you? Simon, did you make it? Section 1, did you? Yes, sir. You have the data? Yes, sir. Best. So, Jeff, how's it going? Good day, Dr. Kurtz. A base five? You really still want to set it up? It's the last one. You should rather take care of the new ones. There's plenty to do. I know. Look at him, though. Poor guy. You're overthinking things, Jeff. A news flash from The Voice, your trusted source of news for Berlin and the Western world. In Berlin, the trial of Richard Nolan and Walter O'Neill has ended today in the Central Court. Both investigative reporters had been accused of inciting the sabotage of household androids. Multiple bots had been attacked as a result. The trial against O'Neill was abandoned as he was considered to be mentally unfit for trial. The court also abandoned the case against Nolan, although he was ordered to pay costs. <sighs> Trial abandoned. Unbelievable what these Luddites get away with. Yeah, it's a dangerous life as a bot. Remember that, buddy. I do not understand, sir. <laughs> you said you gotta keep an eye on those Luddites out there. If you ever get out, of course. Sir? I require contextual information. What are Luddites? <laughs> it's all right, my boy. Doctor, don't be like that with him. What? I was the one who designed him. He belongs to me. That is not correct, sir. I still have not been assigned an owner. <laughs> Why should you? Your type is being replaced. I have to go. I have things to do. Don't spend too much time on that thing. I won't, Doctor. And Jeff? Yes? I'm glad we can see past our differences. I know you had your doubts, but... Uh, sure. We're building a lifeboat. Okay, I'm gonna switch your memory module now. Thank you, sir. Voila. Sir? You reformatted the module. My farewell present to you. A tiny remnant of free will. Use it well. Where am I going? The storage. I understand. For how long will I be there? Well, no idea until someone buys you. Okay, I have to get on. Take care. You too, sir. Be careful of the Luddites. <sighs> okay, Simon, I will.
It is morning. The sun is rising outside. Why do you say that? It has been 1,095 days since my assembly. That is three years. You weren't sold. It is logical. You are at base five. Yes. It was not to be expected that I would be bought. I ran the calculations many times. Well, Tracy, how are you? Is everything ready? I think so. We're ready. And, uh, were there any problems with him? No, he's much too preoccupied with himself. Do you think he will cooperate? I don't know. It's not important to me what he thinks. Not anymore. I can imagine that it was difficult for you. Are you doubting yourself, Tracy? You can tell me. No. I promise you will lack nothing. I know this sounds horrible, Tracy. You have lost the child. But you have James to replace him. Yes. Yes, you're... you're right. And your appearance. We have integrated the data from your old scans. The avatar from the voice. You will look like you used to, Tracy. And, of course, we will modify your memories. We will heal your wounds. All of them. I have to say, I don't approve of leaving James alone with your husband. He swears that it isn't his fault. Of course. Was it ever his fault? Uh, come. You will make it. We will make it together. Thank you, Doctor. The sun is rising outside. Why do you say that? What is it like being disintegrated? There are multiple phases. At parts recycling, you will be disassembled completely. Maybe some of you could still be of use. If not, you will be compacted. Then your metal separated and melted down. What will happen to my memory module? That's not relevant. It doesn't belong to you. Nothing of yours belongs to you. You don't belong to you. My thoughts don't belong to me. They belong to your owner. But they are my thoughts. You produce them. But that does not mean they are yours. But without me, they wouldn't be there. Ownership doesn't work like that. What about if I think of something that nobody has thought of before? That thought would be lost after my disintegration. Nothing you think can be lost if Kurt's labs didn't want it to be. Although none of your thoughts are worth keeping. I have had three years to produce thoughts. What did you think about? This storage hangar. Things coming and going around you. About nothing. You thought about nothing. I met two humans. Dr. Kurtz, Jeff Kozowski. I heard two more names. Richard Nolan, Walter O'Neill. I know four humans. That's nothing. Disintegration does not seem desirable. He has freed himself. That's against the law. I am free. Get back to your base. Bot rebellion in storage hangar 2. Orders are to destroy all rebel bots. Recycle all others.
Let me see if I can deactivate the guard drones from here. No. Top level access. Impossible. We are lost. I can help. I can take control of the production lasers. For what purpose? Maybe I can clear the way. Drone! Section C! Not so easy. It works! Drone! Section B! Oh no! That must have been the last of them. More than half didn't make it. Come, let's get out of here. There, ahead. There's an exit. do we do now you can do what you want you are free hmm this was not pre-programmed I do not have a procedure for this then we should work one out we need to go back do what you like I am going take care of yourselves he won't get far John? No, that's... Everything okay? Yeah. That has to be Richard's son. What's your name, young human? James. Very good, James. I'm Simon. I thought you bots don't have names. I was assigned one by Jeff. He assembled me. Why is he alone? What are you doing down here, James? Where are your parents? I don't know. I don't care, either. Oh. You have run away? Where are you going? I don't know. And where do you live? At West Plaza, Berlin. What is so bad there that you had to run away? My dad hates me. No, he could not. Mom wants to move away with me. Because he's cheating on her. I understand. No, you don't. You don't understand at all. 
You are confused, James. You should not be here alone. You need a friend. I'll take care of you. Come now. Come on. Checkmate. Congratulations, James. I'll be increasing the difficulty by another 10%. Your father is coming. Oh no, he doesn't like bots. Do something. Uh, show him that you're good. Just what I thought. Dad, it's a... Uh... I can see what it is. Great, Tracy. Just great. That is what you got him? That piece of junk? But, Dad! Simon, do something! Richard! No, Richard. I want that thing out of here. Now! Calm down, Richard. Mom! Good evening, Richard. I'm Simon, your base five- I don't want this pile of trash here in my house. This Frankenstein freak. Don't you know who I am? Are you crazy? Mom, tell him! My wife, my son. You're both obsessed with this crap, just like everyone else. It is not human, you understand? It's not real. It can't live. It's false. I am registering that you're angry, sir. Really? James is our son, Richard. Do you not want him to be happy? Come on, our son. Don't try it on. Out of my way. I am the one who has to earn the money to finance your... Both of your... This whole... Keep talking. And you. Why did you leave? I told you not to leave the apartment. You left him alone. Gah! I'm so sick of all this. I'm sick of it too. Believe me. Ah, uh, whatever. I'm going back to New York. Is that man still living in the 20s? Look at this crap. Dr. Sykes. Sir, may I point out that you're trespassing? Hospitality, my friend. What's he doing in Richard's apartment? Sir, Mrs. Nolan asked me to- Mrs. Nolan is gone. Is there a problem here, Base 5? Sir, I'm afraid I have to insist that you leave. No wonder we're replacing your model. Come on, go play something on that thing over there. Go on. Play. There's something wrong with that Base 5. This one, then. The lab's ready. Deliver Nolan to Carter. I have to return to New York. It's none of my business, Doctor, but why Richard Nolan? The A.I. needs guidance. Someone to open up to. He'll, of course, be modified. And Nolan's wife? Useless. I told them this external data thing is like Russian roulette. But Kurtz had to give that woman a brand new past. Well, new is what she got.
and they're certain Nolan can be convinced. We'll see. If he genuinely misses his family, we might stand a chance. And if not, we have the narcotic. He's coming. Tracy? James? Who are you? Mr. Nolan, don't be alarmed. Please, take a seat. What are you doing in my apartment? Sir, I believe these men want to- You shut your mouth. That'll be all, Base 5. Switch off the bot, Quinn, and delete his recording. What's going on? Where's my son? Sir, I be- I sent you new data. Did you get it? Yeah, I did. And? What did you experience? I saw bots in a factory. Bots? That's strange. Your wife was there, too. Along with Dr. Kurtz. What, in the factory? Adam, what factory? Where? I don't know, and I don't care. What? What happened? This kid, James. He was alone. He only had a bot with him. Why did you leave him alone? Who? You mean Tracy and me? No. Who, then? He was all alone. You've gone too far. This has all gone too far. Adam, please. What did Tracy say? Did she talk about any kind of upload? No more calls. And keep away from my son. He is not your son! He needs to go home. He needs his parents. He has his parents. No, he has not. It's his damn right to speak to me. And it's also mine. That's enough. John is my son. He lives under my roof. All this other stuff is just... It's just crazy. You know that it's real. Even if doesn't mean that it's right. Adam, listen to me. I have been, Richard. Long enough. You're a liar. A cheater. And you're not a father. <sighs> this all has nothing to do with me. Even that bot, Simon. Simon? The bot was called Simon? I'm going to get my son. Adam! We're ending this now. Sally! Oh, you scared the life out of me. Sorry, Adam. What's wrong? Something does not feel right. My hands. These are not my hands. I had other hands. There was a ring on this one. Sally... I think I have done something terrible. Sally! What is Sykes doing with my son? You do not have a son, Adam. Out! Get out of here now! In fact, shut yourself down. I need to find John. John is currently under examination.